Three North Alabama nonprofits headed into the new year with some extra money in their bank accounts. And News 19's Hunter Drinker joins us now live with details on how the Madison County Commission is hoping to help fight hunger. Yeah, Greg, uh, Madison County Commission Chairman Dell Strong says he hopes these 20,000 grants to the three area organizations are going to help them put food on their shelves and in turn that will be donated to people who are in need. I went, woo -hoo. <laughs> that was Fran Fluler's reaction when she found out her organization, Mana House, was getting $20,000 from the Madison County Commission. And they asked us, hey, could we help you feed people? And I'm like, absolutely. On Wednesday, the commission awarded the $20,000 grant funds to Mana House, the Food Bank of North Alabama, and CASA of Madison County. All three organizations work to fight food insecurity in the area. It's an issue that's been worsened by the pandemic. Food costs have gone up, gas prices have gone up. But food insecurity doesn't discriminate. It can become a problem in the most unexpected of times. Well, you know, we're seeing a real variety of people. Uh, we always have people who are on chemo, dialysis, going through a tough time financially, or maybe they've had a bad car wreck and they're in rehab. But then we have the people who are trying to make it and they're working and they've got a full time job, but times are hard. That's where organizations like those who have been awarded these grant funds step in. Huntsville is the most generous city I've ever seen, and they love to help their neighbor, and they're just covering their neighbor all the time. Mana House is largely run by volunteers, and I even got a little taste of that myself today. Yeah, I was I was trying to track you down earlier, and I got roped into volunteering. For a second. <laughs> I was like, I'm happy to help out. Welcome uh, to Mana House. We right, will definitely put you to work right. when you come in. And Greg, I have to tell you, I was really blown away today when I was at Mana House by the number of volunteers there and, and Fran was helping get them all in line. And one volunteer that I spoke to today, she told me that a while back she was going through a rough time. Mana House helped her out during that rough time and now she's giving back and doing her part to help other people. And it's stories just like that that this grant funding is going to help these organizations continue to create in the coming year. Reporting live in Huntsville tonight, Hunter Drinkard, News 19. Yeah.